I mean, if you ask your senior colleagues that I have taught before, after teaching, I take pleasures during revision class to go extra mind. How do I mean by going extra mind? What you have been taught that may not be able to dig deep into some areas. I use questions, especially from WASA, to expand sheets. So this is not a period where anybody should miss my class for any purpose, for any reason. Okay, just as I've said before, some of you arrived in class, I said so far so good, we are done with the scheme as regards to term. And as a matter of fact, I have taught you from first term SS1 to third term SS3, and SS1. I want to promote you, you want to jump, you want to jump SS3. Okay? Then, we are going to go through series of revision in the perspective of using past questions to awaken our consciousness based on what we have learned. I believe I'm communicating. Yes, sir. All right, thank you. We're going to use past questions, be it theoretical form or in objective form, to widen our horizon and awaken our consciousness as regard what we have learned so far. But for today, we've just, just concluded the topic tied to constituted authority. I'm going to pick a question from um, Wasse, Wasse 2018. I said Wasse made in 2018. And we use that as part of revision for today. Then from subsequently, we, if, if time permits us, we also look into some objective questions which are programmed here for the benefit of everyone here. Now, before that, let me also assure you that you have the privilege to ask questions at this point where you think you don't understand something better or where you think you need more clarification. You have the privilege to ask questions. Um, uh, this question actually was the question I set for you in my assignments, but unfortunately, there are some of you you have started. You have started. Mute yourself. Don't force me to mute you. Oh, I'm coming. Oh, what is happening here? I think I have too many loops here. Okay, I think I have too many loops on my system. I have to close some. Uh, Allow some things to work very well. All right. This is the question from Wassel, May June 2018. I believe you can see what I have shared. Yes, yeah, sir. All right, thank you. The question I ask you has to divine considered authority. As cheap as the question is, it's unfortunate that some people could not define considered authority. I wouldn't mention your name, but that is too bad. Some of you were telling me that just as the chief examiner noted here, some of you were telling me the meaning of constitution instead of constitutional authority, and I corrected this. Then, 
some were actually telling me the meaning of authority. Why some telling me the meaning of constitution? You know yourself, and you will see, you will have seen my comments in your scripts that I sent to you. Please, let's avail ourselves the privilege to learn effectively. Let's avail ourselves the privilege to learn effectively. Let's I forget the point. You are seeing the first person to come online today. You will still be my governor for this class today. You take attendance for me. First to come to my class to be my governor for that day. So you still take the attendance for me today. So please do not look at this class as a way of cashing fun or keep just keeping yourself busy or something about. There are people in other parts of the world that only learn online. They only learn online. Some will just get the material and study and they write exams. But in your own case, the school has been super anonymous in the sense that we provide a live interactive session for you where you have the privilege to interact with your teachers live. If I'm doing what is strong now, you can tell me. If you're doing what is strong, I can tell you. Okay. So I don't think there's a clear difference between our normal class that coronavirus talk than the one we are doing. The only challenge I feel that we have, which is a Nigerian problem or let me say African problem, is poor network in most cases. And aside this, I always make provision. I record every of our class session here. For adventure, you have been locked out for any reason. You have the privilege to watch, listen to the video later. Eh? And if you have any question in any arena, you have my number. You can chat me up. OK, Mr. Manner, this is what I listen to here, here, and I don't understand it. Can you please shed more light on it? I'll be so glad to do justice to that. That is why I'm your teacher. But I will not be happy. I won't be happy if I have devoted myself, give myself the necessary opportunity to give you the best, and some of you refuse to avail yourself to get the best which I have made ready for you. Please and please. For your information, only God knows. Third time may be cancelled. You may be resuming for a new session for first time and you go to SS2. You listened to news some days ago in your states. Third time has been what? Cancelled. The student will be resuming in September for first time 2020-2021. So if you now abuse the privilege you have in this place, just like Apostle Paul said, that if only in this world we have hope, and that there's no hope for us beyond this world, then we are the most miserable. If you have been coming online here, consume, as in you see your data, your time and everything, and you will not pick everything, I will not say you are the most miserable. So please, in the cloud, I'm saying I'm, I'm sending out this sound because of abysmal performance of some of you in my assignments, which shows that you don't show any act of what seriousness. I will correct something. Some people, some people will still repeat it. You have the opportunity now. Aside today, in our subsequent class, I am going to pick. My topic for revision from topic one to this last topic, but because I just completed this class, that's why I'm using this as a revisional topic today and as part of what I said to put some of some of you did or perform hopefully. You say the word is a no for the wise. And I believe those that have ears will go back and study the videos of the former classes now if you have missed anything. Then in our subsequent class, you avail yourself to learn and ask questions. I'm ready for you. I'm 
ready to give you the best. I'm ready to give you the best. But I won't be happy if you are not giving me the best, just the way I'm trying to give you the best. Okay. So when you're asked to define constant authority, you, have, you can see here, this is one definition. I have the one I did also define in my notes, which is more comprehensive than this. And please let me quickly tell you something. While looking at concert authority, it is not individual or group that are confined by confined authority on or power on by the constitution alone. Remember, we have different type of concert authority. There are certain concert authority that it is the tradition that compared authority on them. Am I saying the truth? Yes, sir. Thank you. It is the traditions, the norms, that compared authority on them. Somebody was, somebody, I think it was the defender that asked me a question that, what, where will you place your parent under the type of concert authority? You remember, I answered the question, right? It said, tradition, because what does tradition say? Eh? What does even the Bible say too? About your parents. Honor your father and what? Not that. That's your day to do what? No. 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 Yes, thank you. Okay. So authority has been conferred on them biblically. Authority has also been conferred on them. The type of traditions. The elderly ones, the balance in your areas. The the others in your area, they have been compared authority based on traditional uh, uh, and the norms of the people. The presidents, the governors, the ministers, among others, they have been compared. Authors have been compared on them based on the constitution of the country. Who is the carpenter? So, please, this is some of the things I noted in the assignment I gave out. It's not only the constitution hmm, that can bested look, look, look at this definition now. It said better with legitimate power to carry out specific duties. Legitimate power. The legitimate power could have been vested by the constitution, by traditions, by legal belief, or by any other thing, but it must be legitimate. When I say legitimate, it must be right. The authority must exercise itself on the confinement on positivity, not on the paradigms of a negativity. I believe I'm communicating. Yes, sir. Thank you. Yes, sir. Thank you. Yes, sir. Thank you. So, you should have understood. You should have understood how to define concept authority now. And prevention, your own question will not be just definition, will be explanations of concept authority. After the definition of concept authority, you are expected to go further by expansion on the term legitimate power. When I say it, to expand it on the term legitimate power, you will not say that the legitimate power compared on the people here could be through the constitution of the country or through the traditions or customs of the people or through the religious norms. You respect your pastor because of the biblical injunctions. You respect your imam because of the Quranic injunctions. Then, after that, you should be able to give instance. For instance, the Obas have been giving, the Oba is an example of the concept of authority in Yoruba land, having been compared with authority based on the traditions and customs of the people. The same thing happened to the Igwes, the same thing happened to the Obi in Indonesia. Same thing happened to 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 Oba Bini, Alaka of Oyo, or Nyo of Ibe, Sultan of Sokoto, Emir of Kano, among others. The tradition has vested that authority in them, and the authority is legitimate, not what illegal. 
If you have done this, you get your full mark. Am I communicating? Yes, sir. All right. Yes, sir. All right. Jessica, you are welcome, or late comma. Similarly, you are welcome. Grace, those of you that are trying to be my class in Bruce, there's no problem. There's no problem. Just like Jesus Christ said, I know my sheep and my sheep know me. Dominion, you are welcome. Please, uh, you may likely chat me up after the class, especially when you think you are having challenges. I think you should see my comments in your scripts. If you have not check the correct, if you not check my cor the corrections. Did you? Mm. Eh? Yes, I do. Okay. Okay. So please, so please, I want all of you to be flying. Hmm? I don't want to leave anybody at lower level. Okay. Then I said you should outline three advantages in my question. And I have corrected this on several occasions. When you have to outline, you have to highlight, you have to describe, you have to you should state your point and what explain there. But to my greater surprise, except few, I think out of the people that answer the question, maybe two or three, I did justice to that aspect. Let's state the point and explain. Please, when you ask to apply, please make sure you state your point and what? Explain it. Write note on it. Then, there's another thing I have noted in your explanation. There are some of you, you don't know how to explain. I'm sorry, let me read this for my uh, Rooney. Okay. Rooney, this is not this question is not for this class. You have my number. When you have issue, I have I, I noticed some of you here, the like of Lake, the like of a uh, melody. Uh, the like of uh, Baba Femi. Whenever they have issue, they chat me up. Sir, what about this? How do I do this? So you are just asking me now, where is you? I have to check your correction. Since I have been stating that for long, it's not for this class. You have issue that you got that, you chat me later. But for reference purpose, I said, in the email sent to you after the publication of the results, you will see what you score, maybe 15 over 20. Under it, under it, you will see view. Under the score, you will see view. Click on it, it will take you down to the comprehensive detail of the, 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 the scripts. And there you will assess my correction. You will see reason why you have scored that mark and you see the corrections. But see, am I saying the truth? Yes, sir. Yes. So, Rune, that is just it. If you have any issue, feel free, communicate to me. Don't keep the problem to yourself. Okay. So, I was trying to say that there are some of you, you don't know how to explain. I corrected this when I was teaching you uh, law and order. That's when you are asked to highlight importance of law and order in the society, you, you don't just say unity. When you say unity, you put column, say law and order ensure unity in the society. You have not explained, you have not highlighted. You have only succeeded in repeating what you have stated previously. If you are asked to highlight or outline advantages of considered authority, like the point we have here, you are expected to tell us how considered authority we get, as in we help us to achieve the number one point. Let's take the number one point for the example now. He said, considered authority facilitates the execution or implementation of the programs of the society or group. Put your full on. 
The consul, can I say the consular authority, for instance, in at the governmental level, the executive help to ensure that the programs and policies of government are properly implemented or executed. I will not just say, I will not just put my call that consular authority help to implement uh, uh, what uh, help to implement uh, policies and programs. That telling you detail how that is being carried out. You should be able to convince to your examiner that you know what you are saying by use by using constructive analysis with the uh, fundamental examples to bring home your position um, for the better understanding of the person reading you. What some of you have succeeded in doing is that you will repeat the points, you will not explain how source and what actualize. Let me listen to somebody. Somebody should explain, assuming you will have the number two as your point and you are asked to outline it, how you are going to explain it. Number two said, consider authorities assist in enforcing the rules and, ensure, and assuring compliance by a member of the society or group. Who is going to explain that? If you have all this, and based on what you have understood what I've said now, I want to test your knowledge as we get that. Explain that number two for me. If you don't raise your hand, I will call you. This time around, if you like, don't show your video, I will call you. Because I think that's what you have been using as a, as a hide and skill. Yes, I will give you an assignment to do rubbish for me. Okay, I have Lake here. Lake, I will not recognize your post. You have always been a good participant in my class. Only Lake. Only Lake. Abi. No problem. Uh, audio will precious. Answer that question. Amongst yourself and answer that question. How do you think consider authority assist in enforcing the rules and ensuring compliance by members of the group or whatever? So answer the question. If you don't answer my question, Ruhu, I'm coming to your house tomorrow. Hmm? You know, you might, you are, some of, some of you know, you know here that uh, all of you are my sons and daughter. Uh -huh. I don't, there's no guru with me. Ruhu. I don't know. You don't know. Is, does it mean that what I have taught you so far, that you don't understand? Don't, um, don't move yourself yet. Does it mean what I've taught you so far you don't understand? Yes, I'm still with you, precious. Sir? Does it mean that what I have taught you so far as regards to state authority you don't understand? Sir, I do, but I don't understand the question you asked. The question I asked is that. Assuming this number two will be your own question now, and you have to outline or highlight it, and number two is your point. I have explained how you were expected to explain your point. You don't just repeat the point, but you must galvanize everything, bring critical analysis to explain your point. I have given a, a, a good example in number one, and I said you should explain that number two. For me, based on the understanding of what I have said in the number one. No response. Okay, no problem. Liki. Sir. Yes. Sir. Okay, sir. Like, for example, now, we have the executive. 
and the executive are the ones that make sure that the um the are you see that oh technically we lost him to network uh, issues divine Stop. Uh, network yeah, yes, uh, your network is in the state of comatose. Okay, please hold on. Let me take the van for now. When your network is back, you respond. Yes, the van. In a society or wherever the consent authority is overseeing their jurisdiction. They use the authority to make sure that the citizens of that particular society or jurisdiction follow the rules and because they have the power, they have the authority to make sure they do it. Just have the authority to punish them if they don't do it and if they don't comply with the norms of society. Yes. Th th thank you, thank you, but you have not able to convince me enough. Okay, it's always good when you explain to use examples. For instance, we have the police hmm, that enforce law and order in the society, Abi, and this belong to the executive arms of uh, government. And based on what you have said. The concern authority in the various localities like the ballet, the obas, even as a family head, you are expected to ensure rules and regulations are obeyed in your environment. Okay, but we are looking at the society at the at a larger level. We'll be looking at the enforcement of law and order through the the law enforcement agent AG, Nigerian police force, among others. Stephen, you get that, right? Yes, okay. Sir. Uh, Leki, are you back? Yes, sir. Can you explain number three? Okay, sir. Number four, go to Baba Femi. Number four, Baba Femi. Number five, is a Zephla here? Zephla is not here. Yes, I'm here, sir. Oh, you're here. Number five is Zephla. So when I mention your number, you come up. Number five is Zephla. Then number six is Pimba Jessica. Number six, Pimba Jessica. Number seven, Saddam. Number seven, Saddam. You explain number seven. Number eight, Melody. Number eight, Melody. Number nine, Timidri. Number nine, Timidri. Number 10, Grace for Monkey Art. Uh, allow you don't think that uh, you are not cited. I'm coming for you. Isaac, Ogwensho, Demiladi, I'm coming for you. Don't think that uh, I don't run away because of network. I'm not sure you are cited. Yes? Okay, sir. You said uh, the question, the thing, the the, it said that constitution, constituted authority helps in formulating um, policies. Yes, yes. Uh, for example, the legislation. Ah, this is your network, eh? it is well. But I had you mentioning legislature. Policies, formulation is the duty of the executive act of governments. Hmm? Formulation of policies and making decisions is the duties of the executive arms of government. The legislature makes laws. Hmm? The executive formulate and implement policies and decisions of government. Please take note of that. Can you use that now as a yardstick to continue with your explanation? Vicky, are you see here? Okay. His network is is working with his network. Eh? Next person. Next.
Number four. What happened there? Second to third authority arbitrates when there is conflict among members of the society or group. Is that difficult? Many of you remember when I taught you legal rational constant authority? Who is taking over four? Is that not Joshua? No, Baba Femi. Baba Femi Abi. Where is he? Joshua is, you see Joshua is not here? Ha, it is well. No, sir, it's not me. Joshua it's it's, it's Femi, sir. Hey, Femi, okay, Femi is here now. Femi. Yes, unmute yourself. I'll do justice to the question. We have eight minutes left. Please don't waste our time. Femi has decided not to unmute himself. I think his network is bad. Uh, okay, is okay. Sure. Saddam. Okay, let me notice Saddam. Let me go and look for those ladies or those guys that have not been given an assigned. Bull what if answer that question? So, um, Some of you are just technically wasting my time. And that is not too good. Tell me, okay, you are here now. Sir. Yes. Sir, um, says um, constituted authority um, helps to arbitrate arbitrates when there is conflict among members of society or group. And for example, when there is conflict, the, um, the, the judge, the guilty party, and then the executive and punishes the people that are guilty. They are not looking at implementation, they are looking at arbitration. We are looking at settlement of disputes. We are looking at uh, adjudication okay. here. Okay. Okay. So don't the confuse executive, yourself. There's, the, nothing, there's nothing that concerns the executive in that point. There's nothing that concerns executive in that point. Hmm? What that means is that, say, consider authority. Consider authority arbitrates when there is conflict among members of society or group. Hmm? What's your color? Okay. Consider authority perform the work or duties of presiding over disputes. So need to mention arbitration or this and again. Whenever such when such whenever such uh, what arises in the society, and the consul authority that started with this notice is the rational or legal consul authority, and that is where we have the the, the what. The judges, the magistrates, the cadets, and the case may be in the Sharia court. That's in the legal perspective. And in, at the local level, based on the customs and norms, even the ballots, the obas, can also carry out the duty of arbitration by coupling their subjects that have engaged in dispute to solve their grievances or conflicts amicably with that aligned to escalate into fracas. That's at the conventional local level. But at the normal national level, constitutional wise, the judiciary carry out the settlement of disputes among members of society that add one issue or the other as means of resorting to that as what resorted to what misunderstanding or conflict. So it's an advantage. Certain is this dispute will help to prevent further deterioration of unity in society. But if the, if the complex has not been settled, that may deteriorate the unity and enhance disunity in the society and also give room for lawlessness 
and the abolition of uh, human rights. I don't know if I'm communicating. Yes, Am I? Am I? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Femi, Femi, Alpha, you get that right now? Yes, sir. Okay, please feel free. If you don't get any at any point, feel free to ask questions. Next person. Next person, you have just one. Let me see, you have 30 seconds. Next person, 30 seconds. Um, the authority facilitates the making of laws, rules, and regulations that guide the conduct of the members. This means that the constitutional authority, which are the government, they help in making laws like the legislature. Thank you, but you have not completed the codified definition. You do actually have the classical idea of what it takes. Although it's like I've said it before. Anyway, constitutional authority helps to make law that ensures smooth running of the country, e.g. the legislature, the National Assembly, at the, at, uh, that is the Senate and the House of Rep at the federal level, the State House of Assembly at the state level, at, le at, at, the, as in, at the level of states in the federations. Then we have the Legislative Council at the level of a uh, local government in each uh, local government that constitutes the federation. They make laws. You know, where there's no law, you know what happens. People will take, people will do whatever they like. And the mighty one will violate the right of the those that are weak. Hence, the reason for the a kind of law that will help to manage the society. Yes, next person. Next person. Jessica. <laughs> so Jessica ran away a bit. She has been online. It's not that it's that turn that she just went offline. Okay. Next after Jessica. Next person after Jessica. This one is very simple now. This. Who is the next person after Jessica? Hmm. Okay. No problem. Let me really take your question. Mr. Emmanuel. Yes. It's Jessica. Yes, I know. So is it my turn? It's your turn, huh? I've been waiting for you. Wow. Yeah, I was even my question again. Okay, yeah, number six. Constituted authority provide role models for the members of the um, group or society. Um, it simply means that constituted authority is the train. Abi? Yes, role models. Yes, role people that people can look up to in the society for the society. Mm, this is the bon this is the simplest point here. How many of you know the basic cardinal of leadership? Who can tell me the basic cardinal of leadership? Yes, melody. One basic cardinal of leadership, fundamental basic cardinal of leadership. Charisma. No, 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 no. How can I but there's something. They said leadership is by what? Courage. No. Leadership is by example. Hmm? Can you get it now? Leadership is by example. Thank you for those of you that send your message. Leadership is by example. You stand. That answered the question of number six. For instance, now, as your teacher, as a consultant authority, 
Do I suppose to do something that I know will send a bad signal? Do I suppose to do, lay my hands on something that when you see it and you copy it and become a threat to the society? The answer is no. And I'm expected to live a life that will serve as a kind of role model for the younger ones. The same thing applies to other leaders at the every facet of life, unlike some leaders we have now that you see them, what they are doing is to be marveled. To be marveled. Hmm? By the time you want to spread the history of Nigeria tomorrow, their great grandchildren will notice that they are part of who that destroyed Nigeria. They are not those such leaders are not role model. Melody mood yourself. Hmm? Such leaders are not what role model. But Every constant authority, be it spiritual constant authority, be it rational constant authority, government constant authority, or rational, or any form of constant authority, is expected to serve as a role model to the younger ones, whereby people with a kind of valuable characters will be produced. Children these days learn faster down, learn faster based on what they see than what you teach them. You will see a child of uh, maybe six months, we carry the phone of the father and put into the air and say, Daddy, hey, yo. Hmm? You say hello. Who taught that child that uh, you carry the phone and used to make up? The fact that that child always look at the parents whenever they carry the phone, then the child has to do the same thing. People learn faster, better from what you do than what you teach them. And that is why it's expedient for constant for, for, for authority at every level to live a life above board, to live a life of integrity, to live a life of honesty in such a way that the generation that are coming behind will borrow a leaf and thereby live by it and become a nationalistic and patriotic citizen. I think I'm going to stop on this note. Our time has been fast spread. Last point, this is 343. In our subsequent class, we'll do more as regards the issues uh, on ground. And I appreciate all of you for your time, for your comportment. And, and I believe that you have learned one or two things today. Um, please be it known to you that Thursday and uh, Friday at the Declare Public Holiday. In view of that, our class on Friday may not hold usually for the benefit of our Muslim brothers here that will be celebrating Salah. I am expecting my own cow for the father of Bruna. Oh, you say Thursday and Friday. It's Thursday and Friday. They have been announced today as public holiday, Thursday and Friday, public holiday. It has been announced by the Minister of Interior, Raul Faregwe Shola, this afternoon. So, uh, for those of you that are Muslims here, yeah, don't turn to Christian this time around. Though. Make sure you send the cow. For the fact that Corona does not encourage any kind of uh, social gathering now, that does not prevent you from sending the head of the cow or just tie the cow, tie the home, and put a tag. This cow belongs to Mr. Emmanuel. The cow will walk to my house, will come here, okay? All right, thank you very much. Take care of yourself, eh? <laughs> bye bye. I miss all of you. Okay? Bye bye, sir. I hope to see you very soon. Okay? Bye.